Matthew 24, verse 36. However, no one knows the day or the hour when these things will happen. Not even the angels in heaven, nor the Son himself. Only the Father knows. What things? When the coming of God. When God sends his children after. What's it? God sends his son after his children. Oh, he's Jesus, no. We don't know the time or the hour because if we did, guess what? I do what I want. I say, guess what? We got another. We'll leave out in 20 minutes. God's coming. Let's get right in 20 minutes from now. But listen, the Bible teaches us you should live like and today's the day that God is coming. You should live like every second of your life. Fearing the Lord, respecting God, giving God the glory, honor, and the praise. Like as if he was to come right now. Like now is the time. Brother, what did I say? I did not sharing this. No one knows. Today's the day of salvation. Amen. Today's the day. Amen. All this. No, let's go. Let's back myself up with what I said about. We always hear that Odella Bell, Odella Bell. How about if I tell you guys the scripture? Go to 2 Peter 3. 2 Peter 3. And over here, the people used to hunt it. They used to argue with the Christians. Because oh Jesus. Oh Jesus, So Let's read. Have you there, Pastor? Verses 3 to 4, we're going to read. First, I want you to remember. First, I want to remind you that the last days, that in the last days, there will be scoffers who will laugh at the truth and do every evil thing they desire. These will be their arguments. This will be their argument. Jesus promised to come back. Did he? Then where is he? Why as far back as anyone can remember? Everything has remained exactly the same since the world began. As far back as they can remember back in the day. Hold on, Mr. But let me tell you what happened back then. Pastor, if it's okay to say this. Jesus never sent earthquakes back then. There was no earthquakes back then and tsunamis. There was nothing like that going on. Amen? Things are now prophesied. Prophecy must be fulfilled. Amen? And things are happening. Prophecy is being fulfilled. Amen? In Amos 8, verse 11. Where's my Bible? And this right here, we just went from the past to the present to the future. Now we're going to futuristic moves. Amen. Amos 8, verse 11. 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 Amos 8, verse 11.